All right, you guys, today check out how to upscale videos here in IRT Video Enhancer. Now, this is an AI-powered video upscaler that I never thought it existed. So we're going to check out how accurate this is. So what I'm going to do first is go to Premiere Pro and I get this 4K footage, which I'm planning to export in a really low resolution. So I'm going to go here to the video and I'm going to change up the frame size and I'm going to decrease it to 720p aspect. I'm going to go with square pixels and I'm going to open up the more and I'm going to scroll down and here we get the bitrate settings. And what I'm going to do is decrease it right now. It's 27 megabytes and I'm going to decrease it and it's going to decrease the size of the video. And it's also going to decrease the resolution of the video. So I'm going to try to pull it all the way down under one megabyte per second, 0 0.50 and I'm going to export it. I can open up the ART video enhancer and check this out. So this is how the video looks like. It's totally destroyed. So we're going to try to fix it. I'm going to drag and drop the video. And here all you need to do is go here to the AI enhancer is a request. Click on preview and it's going to start fixing it. So right now we can see a little bit of result here. So here's going to scale up the size twice. You can see here. So I'm going to go and for example, select the 4K. And check this out, we actually got pretty good results. So on the left side, you can see these sharp pixelations. A lot of pixels are removed. And here at the right side, it's like smoothened out. It doesn't look that broken anymore like here at the left side at the original image. But what I want to do is test out even more. And by the way, you also can go here to the AI model and switch it. For example, I'm going to go with Smooth HQ. And check this out here, we're going to add some more contrast actually. So this is not that bad, but it's basically like a paint effect. So here's basically written AI model, but in reality, this is just a paint effect or, or some sort of special effect that is going to place it on the video. So this method, you also can find it on smartphone, for example, iPhone or Samsung, that they are saying that they have this 100x zoom. And basically when you zoom in, the image is totally destroyed. So they basically apply this uh, after effects on the video. So it's going to look a little bit more sharper, a little bit more smoother, exactly like in this situation as well. For example, I'm going to drag and drop another one and let's preview this. And you can see here the exact same results. For example, I'm going to go with 4K. And it's going to zoom in. So this is what the iPhone and Samsung does. It has a small size image because that's how the sensor works. For example, this size image. And what they do is just upscale it to 4K or I don't know how many Ks and apply the special effect. This is not AI technology, by the way. Now, if this technology would be AI, then it would need to guess the missing pixels and it would need to rearrange the pixels, which is way more complicated than just apply a filter. And of course, here you're going to need to change up the hardware to a GPU compute. So it's going to render faster. And all you need to do is just export. And there you go.